Let it come out and show you. It's Friday. I remember last night when I was showing you the the tower. Well, let me reverse this thing and I'll show you what, what it looks like now. Here we go. Tower's down. Got a couple of cranes working over here. The guys are just finishing up. I'll get things cleaned up. Uh, everything will probably be done either tomorrow or Sunday. Probably more than likely Sunday. And by Monday, everybody will be cleared out. Then we'll be looking for our next assignment. But that's not the only thing I wanted to show you. One thing, one advantage, especially to this area where we're at, we just happen to know about this cool little place over here where you can pick up some really, really nice steaks. There's a couple of ribeyes for dinner for tonight. Um, man, it sure smells good. We're gonna have a good meal. Anyway, I thought I'd drop that on you. It's one of the things about working out here is you spend a lot of time eating. <laughs> Not much more to do. Anyway, you see those cranes working together over there, so... Like I say, they'll uh, look at this thing. It, it'll be some tomorrow, time tomorrow afternoon before they're even close to being completely torn down. And then they'll be hauling everything out tomorrow and tomorrow night. And... Then by Sunday, they'll probably be done with the cranes and we'll have to tear those down. And I'm uh, figuring Monday or Tuesday, we this part of the, of the operation will be complete. So I don't know if we'll still be here or not. We'll find out if they're gonna, if they're gonna frack, they'll probably want us to stay, so. Anyway, a little nicer today. It's about six, seven degrees cooler, starting to cool down. It's gonna be in the 90s this next week, so. I got a couple of things to do on the motorhome. I want to get those done before uh, we roll out of here. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Please hit the like if you like us. And hit the bell if you want to be notified when things are happening. Thanks for watching.